Hello there, how are you? I'm Natalie. Today I want to share some life hacks that are actually really useful. They range from budgeting to sleep to anxiety to a little bit of everything. If you enjoyed these kinds of videos, give it a thumbs up. And if you don't, give it a thumbs down. That just kind of shows me how you feel about certain content. And by the way, we have a brand new podcast episode. Here's a little sneak peek. What scares you the most about eventually being a mom? I hate that question. So many things. <laughs> I feel like, why? Everything scares me about motherhood. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> And let me tell you, we have loved getting your comments and feedback on the podcast. It's really been like a little intimate corner of the internet where we just get closer. As always, you can find us here every single Friday hanging out with you. By the way, I know a lot of you have been wanting to see more vlogs from me and I promise you they are coming. I've been working on a few things, but I think for Q2, I'm definitely going to be doing more sit down, chatty, taking you along vloggy type of stuff. I'll see you next Saturday. Okay, let's get on into the video. Did you know that there's a blanket out there that actually hugs you back? Hello, Dennis Seed is back to popular demand. Natalie is taking a break today. Apparently, you can become a sausage at night and sleep very, very comfortably in an uncomfortable position. Ugh. So this is the claustrophobic inducing thing sausage. I'm gonna look like a morcilla. Let's move over to the bedroom. I've been told by my boss not to go to the bedroom and just apply this here. I will put this on now. Hi guys. Look, my butt is fine. Ah! Wow, you're, oh. the, you look like a fetus. You feel like claustrophobic. What the frick? <laughs> That's gonna hurt. Yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh. Does it feel fun? I wanna try it. Where's Dennis? Comment below. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. Oh my gosh. This type of stuff exists? I'm obsessed. I bought it. I'm not in the mood to talk today. Whoa! What do you think? My husband made me a book advent calendar. I love it so much. It is the most thoughtful gift I've ever had. So this is the first book I opened. It literally is the best. This is the sweetest thing. I forced my husband to do it. Hello, who's Hi. this? Natalie. Forced labor? <laughs> I love to purchase books. However, I am not one to really read the books. So these all came from my beautiful library. I've never packed so many gifts in my life. What the hell? <laughs> the quickie, ooh. Show the author on the other side. <laughs> Infinite book hack. This is my freaking Kindle. <laughs> it's a Kindle. That I don't use, low battery. When you love a dog. It's Jupiter and me. This is so fun. Oh my God, I love this. My neighbor, Totoro. <gasps> This is the climbing Bible because we love to rock climb. You've never actually read it. You haven't even shown how well I wrap these things. Yay! Okay, this is by my girl, Shan Boudram. Oh, The Adventures of Dennis. This is actually a book that Dennis has had since a little kid, so check it out. It's used. Wow, this is perfectly wrapped. My wrapping's <gasps> too good. The Five Minute Journal. <laughs> Yay, I love it. The Secret Garden. She looks at me on my bookshelf and I genuinely get scared. Oh, I love you, Dale Carnegie. Public <laughs> speaking for success. Flawless wrapping. Neil deGrasse Tyson. Oh my God, so cute. Little Caterpillar. To finalize the very last book, The Iliad. Honestly, do this with your friends. I just knew I need this. The fact that this looks like my husband, I'm a very anxious person and I was like, this is perfection. Oh my God. First of all, he has a butt. Very cute, very, very cute. You can pluck. I feel like this is gonna be so helpful with my anxiety. I feel like with my ADHD, it just like kind of gets worse, but to have this around, honestly, it's gonna be weird. I can't lie. Oh my God, it comes with the tweezer? No, no, no. You get to squish its butt too. Wow. You ready to pluck one with me? Whoa. Ew, it's kind of like a blackhead. I freaking love it. Is this my new favorite pastime? I'm gonna go put this in my wallet. Somebody might look at this wallet and be like, you got a little bit of problems. And I do. Hey handsome, can you come here for a minute? How does that look like me? The hair. So basically you get to like pluck his little hairs out. Isn't it Did he just throw that on the floor? Yeah. I will say $22 for this is so much money, but I like it. 
I bought it. Here she is in all her glory. I need to confess something. I was reviewing my bank statements and this does pertain to this. So one moment. And I have spent $20,000 on Amazon this year. Are you kidding me? Where did it go? It's crazy. Can I justify this purchase? I think I can because I need it. Here is my newest self-care product. She is gorgeous. She is white and she is beautiful. I have never tested her out, but I do feel like this is gonna, uh. So I kind of suck at instructions. Not that this is too difficult, but honey, the husband is here to his. I got stuck for a second. <laughs> we have an aromatherapy tablet and we have a vanilla sachet. And it warms up to 122 degrees Holy and to not shit. touch the inside, only the blanket. So in goes the towel. And so then you can it. use a fragrance disc right there. You slide it in underneath this thing. Ooh, that smells really good. Bam. There. We'll check back in. Oh my God, I smell it. Hmm. It doesn't seem hot. <gasps> I feel so cozy and luxurious. Oh my God, there's something else in there. What the heck? You can actually heat your squishmallows in this thing. Oh my gosh. Wait. It's our podcast coming in 2022. Wait, 2023. My bad. Do you love it or not? It, yes, yeah, it's very nice. I can see this being very useful in a non-necessity way. I don't know if we're ever gonna use this to be honest. <laughs> a little too fancy. Okay, my green binder. My new laptop will be getting $5. Deck is getting $10. 400 Cash stuffing. Welcome to your very first life literacy class. What is cash stuffing? I used to be appalled by the idea of budgeting. I was like, ugh, like I just didn't like it, okay? Until I looked at my bank statements and I literally spent $27,000 on freaking Amazon last year. That just ain't right. If you feel like you're terrible with money, this is going to be a very visual way for you to realize what you're spending and what's coming in, what's coming out, and just to control your finances a little bit. And it's actually kind of fun. So let me show you. So here is my gorgeous wallet. Here's a cute little picture of Dennis. Here is my wallet binder. It is so great and so amazing. So the idea here is that you create categories of different envelopes for different areas in your life that you like to spend. This is one of my little binders. Here is some fake money. And inside of them, you are basically just going to stuff the amount for your budget. For spending in the month, I like to budget $100. So I'm gonna take a 50 out, a 20, another 20, a 10, and then I would stuff it into my little binder. And then I have three other separate binders. One of them is my family budget binder which is with me and my husband Jupiter and then we actually have one called sinking funds but this we might do for lesson two this system has literally changed my life if you feel like you're someone that's just so terrible with seeing how much you're spending and it's overwhelming try this method out and let me know what you think I will link all these starter goodies over on my Amazon storefront what's one thing you would change about me why do you want to know? What are you going to do It's with a question. We're doing Q&A. You're taking your time to think is what you're doing. No, I know what I would change about you. What is it? Me. Your temper. My temper? Yeah. I got married with this man. The first thing his mom says is, La quiero mucho. Sea paciente con Dennis, que él tiene un temperamento. 